Disheveled. Do you think I'm cruel? <laughs> Putting pat on there. Is that what, what you think? <laughs> oh dear. Oh, like. It's dear to me. Yeah, you'll have to excuse us, folks. <laughs> You're beautiful. <laughs> How many times do I have to tell you? Not that piece of hair stuck for you <laughs> and glasses for. No idea. <laughs> there you go. Thank mm. you. Look at <laughs> You're lovely. <laughs> what have we got to talk about today? Oh, I don't know. No, no, not much. Uh, what is that? Oh yeah, you know I watched Step One this Smut weekend. <laughs> you what? Smut funny, <laughs> tickled you. <laughs> yeah, well, it's do you know on the intro, on the introduction to F One, they show you the um, you know in the airports where the, the cases oh, go yeah, around that yeah. carousel thing, yeah, and, and one falls off. Yeah, you know it's, it's an intro into F One. Well, it just reminds me of all the people that have these cases. They all have these cases with two, four wheels on them, don't they? Not like your case. That you no, no, we're only a two wheel. And they, they're upright. Mm. And they wheel them at the side of themselves. They wheel them. Mm. Everywhere you go, you just see these people wheeling these cases. Yeah. And... When I saw the, the intro and the, the cases, it reminded me of it. And I, and I went, ugh. <laughs> yeah. And I thought, yeah, does that, does that kind of sum, it up. sum up how I feel, <laughs> how I felt about it? Yeah. <laughs> I've been on a 10 day holiday abroad. Yeah. And um, my reaction is, <laughs> when I see something that reminded me of it. Oh, yeah. Oh, dear. Mm. And we got back, and um, Tracy had repainted all the hallway and that, hadn't she? Yeah. And staircase. And she says, Well, I'm going now. <laughs> It was a short welcome. Yeah. Because they were off for a four day. We'd come back on Thursday. <clears throat> Holiday in a caravan. And on Thursday, they've, Tracy and a friend have gone off to um, Lytham. Lytham St Anne's in, near Blackpool, isn't it? Oh, is it? Lytham right. St Anne's, yeah. Oh, is that where they've gone? Yeah. They're in a caravan for yeah. four days. They're coming back today. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> They were just, must have planned that. Well, I don't know. For when we got back. I mean, she'd booked her a week's holiday. So. Just after Christmas, I think. Oh. So they'd planned to go somewhere, but... Um, oh, all right. Because they wanted to, Tracy wanted to do the haul. They only took four days holiday. And they want, they spent the, oh, the other three, yeah, three doing... days doing all, didn't they? Mm. Mm. <laughs> well, the, yesterday wasn't I too bad or not. No. I wasn't too bad here at all. No, it, it'll have yeah. been cold, I would imagine. It's raining today. It's raining, raining today. Again. again. Mm. It did rain yesterday at some point. But Poor not well right. later on. Um, yeah. 
And we've we've been having trouble with Ernie's light, haven't we? We have. It won't come on. Trevor's fiddled with it, and it's it's, it's got come a dodgy, on. It's got a dodgy, uh, dodgy wiring connection. connection. Or That's where the bulb goes in. Because mm. if you wiggle the bulb, bulb, it comes back on. But it needs that to keep him warm. Give him. He does, yeah. Heat. Mm. So I don't know. Mm. We'll have to have a look. And Did she buy a new light? A complete? She that was well, then the complete new light. Now there might be another one in cupboard. The old one that belonged to the other. Right. Because the, kids, the bulbs don't last long. No. And they're not cheap, are they? No. They're not. I think they're about eighteen pounds. Oh, blooming neck! <laughs> I want a blooming last one. Like you pay me. Yeah, I mean she went through affairs at one time where they were going every couple of weeks, didn't she? Yeah. So they're on Maybe all day. Maybe it was like that. They're on all day every Probably, day. Probably yeah. They, they get blooming up. They have to be, don't they? For him. I've read another yeah. reference here, and all oh. it's something that we noticed when we were in the in the the hotel guest it. house um, next next to Hermansburg. Oh up, yeah, the just outside the village of Hermansburg. The old where, traditional. Yeah, where we used to live. Really traditional German place that one. Mm. And some I saw something that I'd forgotten about. And when the, the, these old fake timers that arrived for drinks, they, they, they would have been about our age. <laughs> so and, just smiling. <laughs> and when, timers. Yeah. Yeah. And when they when <clears throat> when they meet, when they, I know I remember it happening in the sixties. When somebody comes and they see somebody they know in a pub, they come and knock on the table. They don't shake hands. No, they say don't shake hands. Just knock, the just knock on the table, and I forgot all about that, that custom. Mm. Um, and when I saw that, I thought, oh yeah, they did. They used to do that. Mm. Mm. Still doing it. Mm. Well, I don't know that younger ones do it. No, no, but, but this is these, it. The old timers yeah. Um, yeah. were doing it, yeah. <coughs> I remember when we were down in um, Cornwall um, that we were talking to a young girl there who worked in a, were it a restaurant. She worked. Yeah. In. And she, she said she lived over at the other side, didn't she, near the sea. But the, the younger end didn't. Um, what am I trying to say? Have a local accent. Yeah, they didn't have a local accent. Um, they weren't relating to their heritage, no. like like um, yeah, no, that's like right. The older yeah. end. Yeah. It, it were it were being lost, she mm. said, mm. with the younger end. Well, Alethea haven't got a Yorkshire accent. No. And no. and I don't think any of her friends have. No. No, they haven't. No. Man, you see she watches a lot of videos and music that comes from but more, Korea and America yeah. and But you think she'd have then have an American accent? No, she but don't. she don't, no. No. Mm. Mm. It's strange, isn't it? Yeah. We we noticed that when we were in Cornwall, mm. all the old older end had a Cornish accent, but not the younger end. No. So I wonder I if saying, the Germans are going to be like that, the German end. I don't know. Yeah. Mm, I won't be surprised. Mm. I was saying to Pat this morning that um, because the Zerm. There's a thing that the young people 
are not go going, are not at work. They don't. Mm. I, I, I was saying to, to Pat, look, our Alethea, by, by the time she's 21, she will have just spent her life studying for studying's sake. I mean, don't, when we were kids, we went to school to learn, to prepare to work, prepare for work, the mm. world of work, didn't mm. we? But I don't think, think she, her studies, prepare, are preparing her for a world of work. They're studying for, for passing exams, for studying's mm. sake, simply to get to the next stage. Um, it's like a, a dad goes out to work and a man goes out to work. I mean, she sees us doing that, like. But I don't know, she knows they go to work, but I don't know whether she knows what that is, what it means. Because mm. she's never done a little job or she's never, paper no, round or no. like that. And there must be a lot like of people did. like Alethea, her generation, yeah. that, that are just no, not, not, not in tune, I've got no concept of work, mm. of what the world of work is like. Yeah. What it consists of. Yeah. Well, that, that young young lad at, um, uh, oh God, that pub that we sometimes frequent. Um, oh, oh, the young lad in Weatherspoons. Yeah, Weatherspoons, that's the word I were looking for. Mm. Thank you. Um, he was only 17 and he was working like... Yeah. They were really switched on. Yeah, yeah. I think he but left school, hadn't he? And he that's exactly there. it. He did not follow the academic route. No. He left and went, well, he'll have, been, he'll have gone to be an apprentice there. I mean, mm. ridiculous. Um, <clears throat> makes well, a mockery of a what job, an apprenticeship they? is. He'll have just got a job there. He well, won't have been a... No, no he won't, because at his age, Prior to 18, mm. you've got to either be in work or oh, training. Right, right. Oh, you've got to be in, in training. You've got to either be in a, a, academia or training. All oh, right. And it, you, it's either an apprenticeship mm. or um, mm. or you, you continue going to university mm. or you do an apprenticeship. It's like right. um, the lady who I rent the storage yard from, her grandson, he didn't go down the academic route. And he's doing really well now. He's Our oldest grandson, mechanic, yeah, he's, he's a motor mechanic. He's um, in his twenties now. And he's he? now he's served, served his apprenticeship as mm. a motor mechanic. He's fully qualified. And the firm kept him on, didn't they? Yeah. Which, yeah. My nephew was a, he worked as an, an apprentice printer, and when he come to nearly his full term, they sacked him. Sacked him. Yeah. So they didn't keep him on, and he'd keep done. Him on. No? no, I mean, and he'd been trusted with doing opening up on the morning and locking up on the night, and you know, I mean. <laughs> yeah, well, well thought of. Yeah, but because it had cost him more money to keep him on, this they they got another apprentice, and they can do that. Whether the scheme's changed yeah. since then, I don't know. Yeah, I don't You're know. going back a bit. I am now, yeah. Yeah. yeah I How old will he be now? 30. In his 30s? 30 odd, yeah. yeah 30 odd, I should mm. think. So ah. we're going shopping today. We are. We'll be spending all those brass, I reckon. Plus, we will. Plus the cupboard's bare. Not well. <laughs> the it, freezer in. I mean, it's the stuff not in bare. The it's bare. It's bare for us. Bare for us, yeah. It's not bare, but it is for us. Yeah. <laughs> so, so we need milk and bread, definitely. And your milk and oh, tea bags. And must need countless well. things. Yeah. Yeah. We will. Uh, does Does any of you know who the Prime Minister is? 
exciting. <laughs> <laughs> I was sitting when I was saying to Pat this morning, I bet Alethea don't know who the Prime Minister is. And Pat says, well, I do. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be all right in one of them tests, you know, for um, Alzheimer's. Now, who's the Prime Minister? Yeah, yeah. Patricia. Oh, well, you'd fail miserably. Oh, well, I don't like it. And what happened on this day? I have no idea. But <laughs> Pat, Pat does not participate in world affairs. No. Any way, shape, or form. Until Trevor tells me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. She don't know what's going on. Yeah. He says, did you know that there have been people killed in Russia, was it? Terrorist attack. Terrorist attack. I said, no. Well, I never listen to news. I don't read a newspaper. And I, I haven't got a phone that I can be scanning news things on like Trevor and Tracy. <clears throat> so if Trevor didn't tell me, I don't know. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm interested. I'm not interested in the media. And work the newspapers and all that crap. I'm interested in what's going on in the world. Um, and I, I, I listen to debates. And, I mean, actually, <laughs> listen to the Iliad yesterday afternoon. Who? Oh. The Iliad by Homer. I read it in oh, my 20s. Really? I read the Iliad and the Odyssey um, in my 20s. And it's it's on audio. Oh, is um, it? But uh, audio book. Yeah. So, because I listening to it. I listen to well, book one anyway. Right. Um, but I told you what I kept falling asleep, <laughs> <laughs> which I didn't do in the twenties. <laughs> in the twenties. Uh, yeah. Which is uh, not good when you're listening to Iliad. It's complex enough. Yeah. The so, misfits, I yeah. think, as you've fallen asleep. Yeah, yeah but <clears throat> I, and and um, I watch old footage of I watched old footage of Germany just prior to the war, and then just after the war when the Red Army came into Berlin, and I was amazed that the, the, the Brandenburg Gate it had one you know the pillars on the Brandenburg Gate it had a massive chunk missing out of it. Well, during, that was in 1945, when the Russians <coughs> came in and into Berlin. Well, in 19, I was, I went out to Germany in 66. Um, it was just, I don't know that it was just after I got married, or just before I got married, 68. Round about then I went to Berlin for three weeks. Um... Not on holiday, it was work. We went with the, with the army. And we went through, uh, on, a, on an, a, a planned excursion through Checkpoint Charlie into, into Berlin. And I remember the Brandenburg Gate because there was a guy sweeping up, a road sweeper, and he had a machine gun o over his shoulder. <laughs> he did this sweeper up, mm. and I thought, that's, that's weird. That's not something you see every day. But I don't remember. I know the Brandenburg Gate had a wall going through it. You know, between each pillar, there was a, wall, a brick wall, o ugly thing. But I don't remember it having a chunk missing out of one of the pillars. Um, mm. Yeah, that, that surprised me. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I just, I just remembered that that... Um, pub we stayed in, in Hermansburg, that hotel, um, it, the owner of that, um, the landlord, he, he, there were cups all over and we yeah. were looking at them and the, there were a photograph of what it, his Prince dad. Charles. His dad was Prince Charles. Yeah. Oh, 30 odd years ago. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I think he said he was In Poland. Were it Poland? It were in Poland. All oh, right. And they were top, it, it won 
They were the champion yeah. of, of horse these. Horse trials. Yeah, you know, these, these, where they, you know, they make the horses. They, it were for... Oh, pony and cat. trap. Pony yeah. and trap. Oh, that's they, it, they horse actually, and trap. Yeah, they actually had the traps. Yeah, they did. There at the hotel outside, didn't yeah, they? Yeah, that's right. Oh, and yeah, horses, yeah. That, yeah. And it... Um, his dad his, came in. Yeah, uh, with, with, he with his, one of, Group of old fogies, old chaps that arrived, drinking around this table. Well, it, his, his, fa his father them. come and joined them, knocked on the table and joined them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you could recognise him yeah. from the photograph, even though he was a good thirty odd years older. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah. But yeah, they they were really must have been well known in the in the in, pony and in that world. Yeah. Won lots of trophies yeah. and mm -hmm. cups everywhere. Yeah, wasn't there? yeah, mm. yeah. Oh, it was pretty good. I just I'd forgotten about that. Yeah. Yeah, fancy being the winners of it. Yeah. World champions. Wow. Uh, In that little pub at Major Vermansburg. Mm. 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 Getting to meet the king. Yeah. The future king. Mm. You yeah. see. It, it were more chaps, weren't it? It were not mm. um Oh no it, no. no it were who Prince is it? Philip. Prince Philip. That's yeah, right. It what king. It were Prince Philip. Mm. Queen's husband. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. We do get things a little bit. Yeah, we, you, you can't rely on us. <laughs> 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 we're a bit dizzy. We do. Yeah, they're, they're dippy. Yeah. Right, oh, well. that's this morning's video, folks. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll see you all being well tomorrow, if we yeah. hope to see. Bye. Bye.